What the hell? No. Okay, that felt like it just made things weird and difficult. The game broke? What? Wait, no, it didn't. What? Will? You? Mary? Me? Oh, got you! We had sex with it? Oh, get, we're getting old. Okay. You vampire. Well, that was a really odd death, but all right. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hope you're having a fantastic day. And welcome to, or welcome back to, Angler Fish. The game is fully released. And uh, hey, we're going to get right into it. Maybe see if I can do a long play, although I don't know how many endings it has, if it is linear, or if it's the kind of game that has many endings and needs to be replayed a whole bunch of times because apparently there's a huge uh th they're like gonna be doing oh, well let me let me double check the store page also yeah i got webcam back on we'll be doing more experiments on what to do back and forth but they, yeah they hear they say the release date is not the end station for angler fish they have the release date second playthrough december 15th third playthrough on january 19th and possibly dlc if they sell more than 5,000 copies before January 19th. So, I mean, that's not that hard to achieve, so come on. Hey, if you like the game, buy the game. But otherwise, now yeah, we're just gonna get into it. I'm gonna have to try to remember what I did in the demo, because I swear there's like a, you have like five minutes to try to get as much done as you can. Possibly affects the endings. Don't know. But let's get into it. It'll be a f nice little interesting secret near the start of the game. Something special will happen three times in the game, depending on what you choose now. Three times. Wait, something special happened three times. Make your choice with great care. Hmm. Ominous. Ugh. Also, oh god, which donut? This'll determine the endings? We gotta go with the classic. Curious, though. And yes, the game only saves when you die. And I got so much facial hair built up. My word. Not being on webcam for so long. Wait, what? C64 Game Pass, wait, what? Dwarfs in Space, wait, what? Hit Guy Hits Back? The ER, wait, what? What, the bowling? Wait, what? Are these the three great choices? It, there's four here, though. <laughs> Waiting for other players to, to join may take a year. <laughs> Downloading day one patch. Come back when you turn 100. <laughs> it is no longer part of the service. Buy, on, buy it on Steam. What the bowling? <laughs> You need to buy 10 berries to play for free uh, for today, and 9 berries equals $100. Well, this is, a, this is a pretty bad game. Choose your character. <laughs> Donut. Donut. Uh, choose which one of these Let's Players voices to be our voice. Oh! Alright, we have a whole bunch. Hello. Scottish Geek. Hi. Dude Run. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Joel Megic? Magic? Magic? Greetings. Bat Prince? Hey. <laughs> N hmm. Nico Circle. <laughs> Thank you very much, by the way. Um, but. Hey. It's like they, they reduced my, my, my voice to not be so, I guess, hey. so deep. Oh! Hey, hey. Hi. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, hello, Hi. even. Hey, hey. We're, we're going to go with a little bit of bias and see how my voice gets translated into the game out of curiosity. Hopefully I don't die of cringe, but intrigued by how it's used. So yeah, we're going we're gonna to go with... Uh... Hey. 
interesting choice. My ears will sh uh, my ears will show when you can interact with someone or something. Hmm. Yeah, it parks into like a fox ear. Hmm. All right, so let's see. Happy twelfth birthday too. Good to see you again. Which way? Which? Curious. I wonder if you could get an ending by being just being here and never leaving, though. Probably not. Hmm. Let's just get going then. But it's been a long time since I used the webcam. The game by John Maria. But, um... <laughs> Based on a true story... Did you guys go to a party like this? The groom... Okay, ladies, we're here. Do you really need to call us ladies? Uh, now who is going to be my best man? You know the rules. The lady who gets the most numbers wins the spot. And then the mysterious blonde that vanishes. We also have to try to pet the dog, because the dog can be pet. But there's always like a lot of circumstances. I'm definitely getting her number. You got until midnight to collect those numbers. Let the best schoolgirl win. Guys, before we go in, who's going to be the designated driver? Gonna have to see what we can do outside here. This is like looks like a little bit of rubbish on the left side. I want to try to avoid, like get as many of the numbers. Great, it's a smoking bar. Now we're all gonna get cancer. You can't escape anglerfish if you're not in it. Ugh. I'm not sure if you can actually get killed this way. Very slippery. Hello, doggo. Oh, I don't think he'll let me pet him this time. Alright. This place is getting a one-star review. No chocolate cake! They'll throw the dart. Got that scream. Let's try to get as much as we can done. Okay. Actually, it was just, should I have killed that person? That could have been maybe one of the things like that changes the endings. I'm gonna be paranoid. Okay, let's get a drink though. Yep. We'll try to get as many numbers as we can. It's speedrun style. One number. Uh, they do not say much, huh? I don't know what she wants, so let's just dance. Wait, how do we dance? I know I got her number before, I swear to God. They like this one. I'm sure I could maybe get their number, but we gotta keep going. Let's see. Maybe if we keep. <laughs> oh, this is just you can just grab a number that's on there. Okay, that's good. See, I'm not sure then... Oh, wait. There we go. Lighter smoke. Okay. Can we just dance? Let's see. What? Donkey? Wait, what? Where's the donkey? Wait, what? Don donkey. Uh-oh. 
This place is getting... Okay, wait, we... No. Why... Where did Donkey come from? You, you want Donkey's number? Oh. Son of a... We didn't get a lot of numbers there. Why did I turn into Donkey? I hit the Z button or something, and now my head's irreversibly Donkey. You must escape Anglerfish to get home. How do I turn my face back? How did I do that? Shit. Was it just hitting the Z button? Son of a... Okay, can I pet you? No. Okay, well... If I go back, do I get my head crushed? Hmm. Alright. Do I still have to get the numbers all over again, though? We'll avoid going in there... Alright, well that was instantaneous. Can I pet you? I will ask you a few questions. All I want you to do is answer with a yes or no. Can you follow me so far? Hmm. Come on. Alright. Fine, fine. We don't get killed. Strange. I'm not allowed, allowed to go in here without a No. He's guarding the bathroom. We do have a good amount of numbers. I'm gonna... Have you ever experienced a game that totally surprised you? Well, yeah. She doesn't need it lit. That guy's still there. Oh, so that's why. I can't give her a drink if I don't have him killed. I see, I see. It's the axe key turns you into donkey. Weird. I, oh, you would not have expected that. Now I'm curious what other keys possibly could do things. Hmm. X equals donkey. Weird. I'm not sure if I can get any of the other numbers, so let's just continue on then. Press spacebar to end someone's life. There we go. It's unfortunate, though. I'd want... <laughs> again with the donkey face. I was not expecting just randomly X equals donkey face. Mm. Mm. No. Uh, dead. Hello, barkeep. Just gotta try not to get killed here. Gotta get the ex Gotta get used to the range. Mm. Well, alright. For the most part... Actually, barkeep, nothing? Nothing? Every time you shoot Donkey's eye goes up. Hmm. Alright. The hills are silent. Eh, down we go. Wonder if we'll be able to find more numbers, though. I can't remember if the flowers get me killed. No? Oh yeah, avoid the bones. Trust those. Wait. No. Yeah, I forgot. I gotta move fast. If there is a jar or pot on a table, then you cannot shoot what is on the other side of the table. Yes. Still can't pet the dog. Everyone's still alive for now. Until I do this. Then we need to get some progress. Alright, so we gotta go fast. Without failure. Up we go, down we go. 
up we go, right and left and middle and left and right, and down and up and down. Easy. Alright, this will be more familiar. I remember this from the demo, but... Can I crouch? Is there any way? Mm -hmm. I could, I think, sneak by him, but... But why would I, uh... <laughs> Sad face. <laughs> Curious. Hmm. <laughs> well, anyways. Oh yeah, this part. We'll be slowly guiding the butterflies. Down here, was it? I think. And get some light in the room. There we go. You too. There we go. Now we can see. I'm still really confused about, like, the absolute point or plot of the game, so I'll be a little curious on how it ends, or what, like, maybe the message will be, if there is any. I'll be a little curious. All I know is it's like, it seems as if... Like, the, what are the origins of the party? If it's based on true events, but given this kind of twist. I'm curious on what is also true and what is not. And so many other things. So hopefully some questions will be answered, but who knows. Oh yeah, this part is where I died. Checkpoint? Checkpoint. You got killed, I can't remember by what. Oh, there you are. Hmm. Hmm. I know there's like a way you can get her number that some people were able to discover in the demo, but I never spoiled myself by looking. So much for helping them. That's a big save button. You found a gnome. Will you try to find the rest of them? No, sure. Well, if there's multiple gnomes, it's based on, I guess, finding them. Wait, what? Hello. Oh. Well done for mercy killing that young man, sir. But what does sir get for trying to be kind, brutally murdered? What have the world come to, sir? It's very good to see you, sir. Welcome to your safe room. When you try a new drink, sir, then I will learn what it does. I promise I will let you know what I learn next time we meet. Sir, do you wish for a drink before you go on your adventure, sir? Monday morning. It just kills me. Was this game that totally... Oh wait. Was this game that totally surprised you... Frog Fractions? Wait, what? What? I have absolutely no idea what they just said. Huh. Suicide is not the answer, sir. Do you wish for a drink before... You yes. Devil's Tango. What does it do? What does it do? What did it do? It's like the, uh... It's supposed to be a reference, I guess, The Shining? Like, this has, like, horror movie trivia out the ding-ding. 
I'm not a horror mo movie buff too, but just like, I don't know, trivia knowledge. It's interesting. Wait. Are these how my character has died? If I die every single way, is that a good thing or a bad thing? Hmm. Wait, what? Can I get your number? Oh, damn! Wasn't expecting... Help! I apparently can't help you, or else I get stabbed, so, uh... Oops. I wanted to shoot that jug, but... Do you often experience something unexpected in your everyday life? <laughs> uh... No. I'm an introvert. I enjoy the everydays of nothing exciting going on. I'm kind of fine with that, too. Alright, will you explain to me what the drink does now? Oh dear, oh dear, you are back, sir. Do you wish for a drink? Skeletons will smile when they see you. Oh, I, there's a big... You die. A big cup of coffee. You want? I do have some coffee. With me as well. We're going to drink and enjoy. Oh yeah. Very tasty. All right. I don't know what it did. Oh, oh no! Inverted my controls. I don't want that. I'd rather die. You know, rip my head off. Thank you. I haven't died to them yet, so I need to die to them at least once. Do you have many regular routines? Yes. I'll keep trying to pet you. I'm still curious how I'd get her number two. She dances to this, so I'd presume maybe it's like if I dance, but... I'm not sure, unless there's a button to dance that I'm unfamiliar with right now. Damn it! Actually, wait, I have died to that before. I gotta avoid going there. I think the more I die, the worse things get. I'm going to presume that's a current theory until proven wrong. I'm curious about that one dude that was just lying down I just blasted in the face. So wait, the skeletons, let's look at them. Yeah, they, they smile when I get near them, that's funny. But we're moving on. Wait, what? Triangles, oh no, Simon says. Uh, ah. I did it wrong. Do you like uh, do you like it when people ask you about your expectations? My expectations? I, I like when people ask questions. Because usually it means they yearn for knowledge, and when the person yearns for knowledge, I can appreciate it. So obviously if there's a difference between someone wanting to remain ignorant or not caring versus and dead again, sir. Uh, uh, I, I can respect people, obviously, who want to ask questions to learn more about things. Unless the question is really, like, unless the question they ask you is so stupid or formulated in a stupid way that it makes you, like, lose your brain cells, that's a different thing. But yearning for knowledge is always respectable. Ah, here we go. Yeah, all the different types of deaths. I wonder if getting all the unique deaths gets you a good ending or bad ending. We've melted. We haven't been bitten by the T-Rex yet, which is why we should visit the bathroom every time we can. You want, let's try going back up. If we can, no, no. Okay, we're gonna have to check the bathroom. I know there's that Godzilla death, so we haven't been killed by that yet, if it's part of it. Oh wait, maybe it's like we have to step and hold on to it. Triangle, circle, square. Okay, so it was just... I didn't hit the last pattern, I see. 
Wait, that was it? It was just three? That's not a hard Simon Says at all. What's going on here? Uh, just three buttons. Uh, okay. Whoa. Break room. Hmm. Curious. I'm not sure if that door is something that's a random event or would be there for most people. Let's see if anything happens. Three times the charm. Wait, what? I wonder what that means. Curious. Wait, clack. Why can't I shoot now? No. Uh -oh. oh, what do you mean? Oh. You are going the wrong way. Well, yes. Okay, let's avoid stepping on bones then. They're guarding something. We're going this way. Yep. <laughs> I got stuck on the wall, really. There's like a little thing. A little piece of wall. You got a top hat. If you were a dog, do you know what you wanted to do with your life? I don't have good owners, I guess. I can't pet the dog. He has a top hat. Oh, now let's see if we can fix your weapon, sir, so it does not jam again. Let's go with the no drink. Hey, yeah, yeah! No, but I, I want to get eaten. Wait, what? Now our shotgun shoots geese sound effects. Can we not get eaten ourselves and it's just the person on the toilet? Well, what did the barkeep do to my shotgun? Well, maybe it's an improvement. We gotta move a f move ahead, though. Oh, that motherfucker! I was wondering what was there. I saw there was something behind there, but I was thinking it was uh, maybe the girl in blonde or something. Because I didn't spoil myself to find out how to get all the numbers. If your plan as a dog fails, do you have any backup doggy plans? Sure. Wait, what? Wait, little pot thing from Elden Ring? What are you doing here? Would you please stop killing my children for no reason? I was shooting the pots a lot prior to dying last time. What if I, uh... That's strange, sir. I don't have any recollection of you dying at all. Do you wish for a drink? Yes. Interesting. I'll have to find the other gnomes, though, for sure. I shot a bunch of the, uh, also have to do... Hmm. Odd noise. I can see there's a... There's a dude here. You can see this silhouette. Wait. Also, hello. Huh. Thought maybe you would want me to step on it more. Curious. Mm. Yeah, stop following me. Weird. See if the break room is the same. Get out of here. Gotta see if things change or not. And if the gun jams or not. Uh -oh. Yeah, nope, nope, nope. No gun jamming. Nope. Close. Ooh, what is this? The code is hidden on our website. What? Really? 
a four-letter word. I mean, how do I... Oh, I change it with the mouse. Ah, okay. <laughs> I never hit the escape button before, but okay. But let's check this site, professionalvillains.com. Okay. Ah, we create interactive journeys, and the secret word in one of our games is HUND. That's quick. Is in the About Us section. Actually, I don't. There we go. Uh, wait. Mouse cursor's gone. There we go. Hund. Ayo. Oh, this looks like ER. I didn't play the full game, unfortunately. I was really preoccupied for the time. But... It always did look cool, I have to say. Interesting. Will I get a unique death by being here? What am I doing here? Button? Ah, button. Rat with the key! Uh, wait. How do I get the rat? Um... Okay. Wait, holding E turns off the light? That's kind of weird. Donkey! <laughs> Hit... The X key for donkey. Oh. Wait. Will the door crush us? No. It's just broken. <laughs> nope. Oh, and that thing's escaped. Is the door fixed? It is, okay. I want to see if I can go all the way back over here or if the creature's still eating. Like, the door's open. Maybe need a weapon in order to stop it. Gross. This way, then. This dude's just sleeping soundly. <laughs> no. Yo! Rat! Give me that key! Rat. God damn it. Okay, I probably have to go this way then. I'm not sure. What is the point of, like, mangling the game? Oh, that's still there. I'm curious. Like. Maybe I had to walk in there. Is the rat still. Nope. Hmm. Like, I'm curious how. What's the involvement of- <laughs> What? Interesting. Me is donkey. Don't mind me. What? Alright. Well, so much for the key. Maybe we didn't need it. Not gonna die, nope. I refuse. Hell yeah. <laughs> just they just like drop on the ground instantly like they're like a family guy character. <laughs> it's kind of humorous. But in Family Guy's case, I mean it's due to uh low budget. Okay. You're welcome. Uh oh. I'm surviving. 
Although I'm kind of curious what would happen if I do die in this world. As soon as I successfully win... Whatever it is it means by being here, that is. You can die too. Um, then I'll go back into this world if I can. And... That's really damn dark. Okay, he's dead. Um... Gross. But no, I didn't want to go... Wait, wait, wait. There's the way that was to the right with the let door open with the first creature that chases me, but what's this way then? Oh, the rat. Ah, oh, the rat died. Wait. If that's the rat, but... <coughs> Doggo! <coughs> Borf. <coughs> Borf. <coughs> they don't want me shooting the dog, do, me? Uh, do they? Is this like the developer's dog or something? I don't think the dog will like me doing that. We saw the dog. I hit E to see if I could pet the dog, but I couldn't. So I'm not sure if killing it just means I'm going to get a bad ending. Because, I mean, I'm shooting a dog after all. That's bad. But... I don't know. We'll see. Yep. <laughs> the donkey's face even changed. That's funny. Even Donkey has like a oh shit face. Wait, I'm back here now? Hey. Going the wrong way? What do you mean going the wrong What? Oh, I'm back here. Close. I do want all the unique deaths, so... Alright, we're doing that again. Let me skip ahead and I'll show. Oh, just dying resets me? Weird. The fact that lights just go out weirdly quick is also strange. But, uh... I'm gonna need that shotgun again, though. Looks like that dog is permanently dead. Just, what did it turn into? Like, what is that? I'm guessing it it's the dog, but just doesn't look like the dog, dead body-wise. Actually, wait, or is that... No, that's its head. Okay, I, I get it. I, never mind, I see it. But I wonder what happened to the key. Or if that was just something that was for the original game, but the key has no involvement with this game. Whoa. What are you doing here? Weird, uh... Placement for that guy? A little creepy? I want to know if there's a, anything special about dying to this thing or a waste of time. Gross. Apparently, maybe not. But yeah, let's just get out of there. Alright, so let's see. Some more progress without going in the ER room. We got some buttons. Not sure if we need to have the creatures stand on those. Wait, what? It's legs. Alright. Mmm... If we had something to put on there, or a statue, maybe. No, well, we'll see. Oh. Well, this is weird. Uh-oh. Ah. You can shoot the duckies for... Okay, that's good. Where am I, and what am I doing here, though? There we go. This is a really odd world, that's for sure. Ah! Well, I accidentally went too far. Do you agree that some of the things that hurt the hurt that hurt the most, a little typo, uh, are unexpected? Um, no, I disagree. Things in life that can hurt the most being the unexpected, I mean, there's a chance, but for me it's the things that you kind of dread that you don't want to happen and then they end up happening. It depends on how self-aware of the things you don't want happening, like how aware you are of that. I'm always aware of what I like, and that's why things that I'm not aware of that I like that are catch me off by surprise. Wait, instead of swimming in the poison lake, have Sir thought about hunting ducks? 
Like, what was I gonna say then? Finish off. The... Man, I lost my track of thought. The things that surprise me and make me happiest are the things I don't expect, I'd say. When, things that make me happy that I predict are very lackluster. Because I'm the kind of person who predicts tons and tons of variables, and I predict and expect a lot of things to happen. Hey, here's a new death. Uh, I want to get all deaths, basically, and then probably try to avoid that. Endings might be tied to these statues in a way, but I want all unique deaths for completionism purposes, even if it does lead to a bad ending. But yeah, I'm usually the kind of person who likes surprises, like happy surprises, because I don't often get those. So when they do happen, they're nice. But in terms of negative surprise versus negative prediction... Wait, that's longer now. Hmm. Oh, what? I already double pressed it? Or triple pressed it? If I said that I think you have beautiful fingers, would that make you feel uncomfortable? It'd be weird, but... Uh, I've... The, the human... Animal dog... It, is uh, growling at me. Wait. Uh oh. I don't know if I want that. What happened to the doors? Wait. Wait, did both sides go the same way? Hang on. Let me double check. Does this lead to the water? Oh, it does. Hmm. Weird. Alright, well, I wasn't expecting that. I can't remember if there were any doors on the bottom left or not, or if it was just the top left and top right. Hmm. But that means it is a shortcut, and I didn't need to actually go through here. The puzzle's basically done. Alright, well. Let's see if there's anything with shooting the ducks repeatedly. No. Alright, moving on then. Because we don't know what to do with the, uh... The pressure plate. Hmm. I think we... Went, went. Hmm. Oh, fishing. Very wholesome. Hmm. Is this, like... The developer, or... I'm not sure if there's like developer easter egg or the character we're playing. He's got a necklace around his neck. Not sure what that's about. Not sure if it's like the character in-game related or... Could be. Another door opened. I want to know what the noise was over here. And why this chair? Your TV has a weird sound. Okay, what? Oh, the door closed behind us. All right. Still got to find the other gnomes. I haven't found any others. No. You're definitely not dead. Hell yeah. Break room. Oh. Froken Frost? Oh. You will find the code in a safe in the free... Oh, wait. wait, you'll find the code in a safe in the free game hunting, Huber. You'll find the code. Ah, oh, come on. What? The code for ice cream? Oh, no. Crap. And a safe and... <sighs> Hunting Huber. Let me check out what the game is. Hunting Huber. Wait, what? Hunting Huber? Okay, wait. It's a previous game they made. Hunting Huber. 
A mini game uh, is a mini open world horror where you are hunting a werewolf. Interesting. They uploaded that when? I don't remember the hunt a werewolf. Hmm. In a safe. I'll see if I can find out the code. Give me a sec. Alright, apparently it gives the code at the end of the game. I see it now. Code for the break room is 0421. Aha. 0421, eh? Gotcha. 0421. Oh, ice cream. I wonder if that's going to lead to the better ending. Don't drop it now. Alright, he ate it happily. Maybe this will go for a a good ending if we do all those. Maybe. Hmm. What if we shoot all the chairs? Maybe we'll get like an angry chair god. It can be some time. I'm gonna skip ahead and shoot all the chairs, quite literally. That chair trying to move. No. Haunted chair. It's supposed to be like a joke about the, like a studio station making games. Not sure. Gnome! I saw you. Excellent. Alright, we got hopefully the second gnome and not the third gnome. Hamburger. Hmm. Curious. Not sure if this is supposed to be a reference to, like, the developers working at a studio before, and this is just, like, sort of a joke representation of a work studio. Again, I'm not sure... Since it's based on a true story, I'm going to presume it's a mix of, like, in-character backstory as well as the developer's backstory, like, injected into it. I could be completely wrong, but it's just my theory as is. Hmm? Nope. Hey, that's good. Wait. I was about to be like, uh, I, I got time to run, but then I was like, but I need a unique death animation. No, oh, okay. Ooh. I, I want that coin. I want the coin. It's shiny. Can, please? C can you help me get that coin? I want that coin. Donut. Wait. No. No. No, but the shiny coin. The donut. A cop? I, I can't help him. Alright. He had a key. I'm really confused. I want that shiny. Look how shiny it is. What is it even? A key, though. Mm. Ah, I see. Well, I want it, so... Whether it's a trap or not, I want it. It's shiny. Shiny things attract me. No! No taking my coin! You're kidding me. It was a trap. I'm gonna get destroyed, aren't I? Yep. Yeah. I don't think I can shoot it, but... Maybe... nope. Flattened. Well, unique deaths, unique deaths. I, I gotta go for all the deaths, man. Would you still not feel uncomfortable if I intertwined fingers with you? I mean... Yes? I mean, you're a dog, so I mean, it'd be silly having your fingers intertwined with a dog's beams. If it's a random, random, oh no, that was the third. No, I didn't find the second no. I feared that you would run into that thing, so. Hey, more drinks. 
Hermes. Make me fast. <gasps> Coins. Wait, what? He turned into a peppermint? Yeah. I'm petting the pep. It's, it's like censorship mode. What the hell? That's funny. Do you think that your task is too hard? Eh. I'm fine. No worries. Still can't pet the dog, though. So let's see. What, what would it be called? You... I... I... I yes. Vampires. Therefore, I have prepared a vampire shield for you. It can once withstand an attack from a vampire. Do you wish for you... A va vampire shield? What? So what does this do? Enemies will move faster. Oh. But they got turned into peppermints. Headless chicken. Alright. Wait, why are there still peppermints? Oh, okay. And it's a beer. Okay, that felt like it just made things weird and difficult. The game broke? What? Wait, what? No, it didn't. What? Will? You? Mary? Me? Oh, got you! We had sex with it? Oh, get, we're getting old. Okay. You vampire. Well, that was a really odd death, but alright. At first, I thought it was like. Maybe someone in the development, like, asked unironically for. A person to propose to a person in the game I was like thinking it's like oh yeah what, what is this gonna be a person gonna be like will you marry me Emily and then a girl out there in the world will be named Emily and see the message and be like and it'll be the, one of those kind of unique random proposals you don't expect like you know you get like someone flying an airplane saying will you marry me kind of thing but in a video game I was first thinking this is that not a, a silly gag do you want to get a surprise in the bar yes I love surprises now it makes things intriguing Ah, uh, this is not a um, surprise! Yeah, uh, well, I, I guess we're running in without a shotgun. Let's see, any... Yeah, our flattened is one. But it's building this... Whatever this is, like, someone's face. Who knows what'll ha... Oh, thank you, yes. It still gave me the shotgun. I'm gonna see if I can use this dude to step on the button. Hmm. No idea. Not sure what about that. Not sure if I'd need to, like, get both monsters who used to be there, get two or three of them to follow me, maybe? Not sure. Wait! I see the lawn gnome! Yes! Okay, the second one was there. Alright, nice. Good thing I saw it. We got the second gnome. Maybe I have to make a video, the video title, and be like, All gnome locations! Something to attract certain people who are uh, completionists. In this room, what I'm going to do, I'm only going to shoot the chair out of the uh, monitors that are flickering. Just see if that does anything. Hmm. Like, could I shoot this thing? Could I? I want the shiny, but it's probably a trap. Ah, oh, the shiny's not even there anymore. Alright. Alright, fine. We'll get the key. Wait. <laughs> Sorry. I need the key. And it's in your throat for some reason. But okay. Um... 
And the game has a lot of surprises. I'm not even sure how many deaths exist. It's quite unpredictable. We're gonna have to run f away from it, aren't we? It's gonna definitely chase. Yep. Yeah. Oh, you. S nice try. Yeah, I mean, it's not gonna be too hard. But I wonder if I could go. Go back up or not. Let's see. I wanna see if I can damage it or not. Okay, never mind. We should just rush. Shit. A little too close, but okay. They want us to go in that room, so we're gonna avoid it. Never mind. We have to. Let's do it. See, I'm fine with marrying her. She's at least got blonde hair. And she looks very confident. Um, let's see. What can we do here? Hide behind it. Shoot it. Hmm. Jump down a hole. Oh, great. Who knows where we even are now? A dark maze. Our guy does not look uh, very pleased at all. Crunch. Crunch. <laughs> nope. Weirdly enough, they're also already wounded for some reason. I wonder if there's a reason for that. Actually, wait, we already- this is the start. Do we have a choice to go anywhere else? We have left down there and left up here. I want to explore the entirety of the maze. Hmm. We also got to check out what the, uh, getting that second gnome gets us in terms of drinks. We got to find all four gnomes. A new area. <laughs> a thwomp from Mario? From Dad. It's almost like the, uh, the marriage ending with the vampire. So they're vampires. I didn't know they were vampires, honestly. I thought they are just some kind of some demon ladies or whatnot. It was, uh, just gonna... <laughs> yeah, I saw that happening. But, again, all deaths, even though that death is flattening, too. Did I surprise you? Yes. Good job. Alright, let's check out that other drink. Some deaths are like people. Some shine and some don't. Do you wish for a drink? Um, wait. I thought I'd get more drinks. Head graphics will not be displayed. Hmm. Well, I gotta just find the fourth gnome. Whatever. <laughs> Holy shit! Wait, they're illusions? How many of them are? Jesus. Maybe all of them were illusions, but that was also quite the surprise. Was not expecting that. No. Alright, we're gonna ignore that thwomp now. Ooh, another break room. Oh, fishing? Yeah, fishing! I like fishing. Fishing mini games too. Hmm, backstories or memories? Let's go more fishing. There, there maybe could be a secret, honestly, unless it's the exact same animation every time. Oh my god, I found him. I think that was the fourth gnome. Either that or just a random gnome, but I'm going to presume that's the fourth gnome. Interesting. Because a game that basically prides itself on surprises... That prides itself on deaths, variations, and, you know, unpredictable things. I knew going fishing more than once had to do something. It's good that you can still be surprised. 
Otherwise, life would be boring. Yeah, I completely agree. There's no such thing as... The only time you'd ever be so dulled with simulations would be like if you've lived a billion years and you've just seen everything. Like, say, if you've... Let's say, um... What was that? The anime that's like called To My Eternity with the main character with the white hair whose name is, uh... Oh, what was it? To Your Eternity and the character being... Ah, uh, and I remember. Fushi! Yeah, that's it. Fushi. To Your Eternity and Fushi being the main character. Yeah, I did find them all. Nice. But yeah, Fushi. Uh, there's one of the characters, the man in black, in his circumstance would be the only time, if you know that character, know who I'm talking about, what I'm talking about, he would basically be so bored of existence from having seen and witnessed and done and seen and thought and done everything conceivable. Then and only then would you probably have zero surprises left in life. Do you wish for a drink? Ah, oh, there's no more? I just got all the gnomes, though? What the fuck does that mean? The chest opened, and it's a flower with shoe. Now look for- like, I know I've seen those flowers a few times. Let me see if interacting- interacting with the flower does anything then. Like this one. Oh. It grants me immunity now? Ah, uh, we, can't, we can't even redo that, uh... Interesting. So now, every time we touch the flower, we get some kind of buff. Probably a Super Mario reference more than anything else. Should we turn the bearded bartender into a woman? Sure! Oh god! A, a busty one at that. My word. Um, interesting. Not sure, there's an... Okay, so we're back where we left off, finally. The fishing room there. Uh, wait. We have to keep... Okay. You. No. But that music, it makes me think it's... It made me think it would be one of those things where the uh, floor key, like shoots at me with the tentacles and I'm supposed to run. I'll break all the jars too. Am I meant to be running, maybe? I'm not sure. Fucking kidding me! Don't lose hope. Uh, he, he got up and killed me. I thought I was gonna be able to. Do you regret having this conversation? No. I uh, wasn't expecting to instantly die there, but I'll get back there. I don't give up. We believe in you. Uh, at least the skeletons are bros. Almost there. They're all... They're still rooting for me. They're still rooting for me. We believe in you. I'm like, they're everywhere. You're the man. As you die an X amount of times, the skeletons just start, like, rooting for you. I don't need... I don't need it, but I guess it's appreciated. Because the comical thing is, like, if you go to the... ASMR break? Wait, what? Normal. I think the game is like on default, jokingly on very hard mode. Go get them, we believe in you. Funny. Go get them. One more time. I'm not gonna lose hope, it's not like the game is Dark Souls or anything, but jeez. Wait, this fuck- <laughs> this dude has a beard now. He's the oldest of all vampires. Alright, shortcut. 
Wait. That's not a shortcut. Oh. But you're... You're alive. Great. We need to open that door to get out. But the price for opening the door is high. We have to sacrifice a human being. You have probably already thought about who's in the bag. It's Jarek. Who would even miss him? He wouldn't dress up like a Japanese schoolgirl like we agreed. We have to pay the price to live. I chose this place, therefore I should be the one who has to live with the blood on his hands. So give me your weapon. Uh... Okay, I'm just gonna go over here, thanks. What, what is over here? This door will only open if Anglerfish ha has over 100 reviews on Steam. What? Interesting. Well, I'm playing it when there's only like 10. So I guess I'll have to come back later. Huh. Wait, what's back down here then? Oh, I didn't. Okay, well, oh, fuck, no. Well then. Hmm. I was expecting you to have figured it all out at this point, so I actually, uh, I actually do not have any more questions for you. Yes. I wanted to pet you, though. Hmm, alright, but we can- wait. Wait, what? Uh, remind me of the pyramid head. Why was it there? No, alright. We'll have to make a choice, maybe. You're alive. Uh. Can I not take the bag with me? Are you already like. Eh. I killed the groom. Okay. So, ah, can I get your number? Can I get your number? You just shoot the bottles. Shoot the jars first. Hello. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh my god, he turned into a sea pupper! While you were dying, I came up with a question. Do you prefer games that break your expectations in a positive way? Yeah, I already had that rant. Yes. Yeah. How's that? Wait, what? Be cool, this is a robbery? I'm here to help. If my help is not appreciated, I will execute every last one of you motherfuckers. Huh. Also, wait. Weird. Alright, I'm gonna get back there, I guess. We're gonna have to kill her rather than, you know, get eaten by her. We have to find out more unique deaths, though, but I'm not sure... I don't think there's a way I avoided any unique deaths. I swear I've gotten, basically, all the unique deaths. Hmm. Well, I don't know. Let me get back to the end. Wait, something's underneath it this time. Blood. I don't know, I already shot preemptively, so unless it's like after I come back there an X amount of times... Is the dude still dead? Alright. What if I give it to you then? Are you just gonna shoot me instead? Huh? Motherfucker, I knew it. Is Call of Duty one of these games that break your expectations? God, no. I mean, the newest one's got good visuals, got good graphics, but that's about it. Oh, the ducks are kissing! That's new. Alright, we're gonna shoot this bastard then. We can't pick up this bag, which I find all too strange. I'm curious if there's something more abnormal in there. Hmm. Well, anyways, uh, since you eat me... Uh, okay. Alright, now, where is it all going? What's going to happen? Can I get your number? Uh, 
Had to guess the right one? I could melt to that. I don't want to rush all the way to the bo- oh. God damn it. I want all the unique deaths, but it's like, uh, do you know how many times you've died? No. 36. Only 36? Only? Hmm. Anyways, like, I want to get all the unique deaths, so I presume it's like, if I get hit by the green acid, it's a different death. Ugh. God damn. Let me recheck. <laughs> They're laughing at me. <laughs> Fuck you. Well, that was a surprise, too. I'll relook at the statues. I'm going to presume, like, the last... Oh, they're teleporting me. Thank God. Oh, God, thank God. I'm getting an actual shortcut now. Okay. Then, yes, I'm going to get all the unique deaths that are a part... Fuck you. Uh, a part of the... Uh, this boss's attack repertoire. Because we've got eaten by this person. There might be a unique event where, like, hitting E doesn't get you killed, but... I don't know, maybe you kiss her and you just... You get a silly ending? I, I don't know, man. Either way. This Gygus boss. I want to get hit by the poison then. Then I'll skip ahead and go back to it. Oh, okay. It just pushes us. Oh, that's... Wasn't what I was expecting. One of them could melt us. Did you notice the castle ruins in the background on your way here? Sure. It's been a while since I was at the intro, but I'll just say sure. It hurts so much each time you kill me. Well, that's what you get for betraying me. And shooting me afterwards. But yes, now we're going to actually try to win this time. It's been a long way coming. Not sure, though, if I could do something else about that. Hmm... Eh, whatever. Back to the boss. No. Oh, the slippery movement got me killed. Oh, that's painful. Okay, the castle ruins are Kalo Castle on Moles. Have you ever seen... Oh, it's a real castle. Uh, no. I have not. I still can't pet the dog. Ah! He fucking shoots himself. That's funny. Uh... I guess they, like, maybe it's, like, they expect a lot of people uh, to die to the boss fight, so they just make funny, unique animations then and there. Wonder what else they do other than just... Maybe I'll come back and he'll be dead. Anyways, let's, let's fight the boss for realsies now. I just gotta remember, like, if I move a little bit, then the shotgun remains there, I see. No, uh, uh, yeah. Nope. Two more. Nope. Got hit, and that only pushes you, weirdly enough. Nope. One more. Whoop. Oh, you tricky son of a bitch! Oh, you're kidding me. I wasn't expecting that final one. Did you know Tolkien borrowed some names from moles? No. Interesting trivia. I thought the dog ran out of questions. Now he's just got interesting trivia. Wait, I came back and it's... Her health is already that far? So I just said... Oh, that's big. Alright. Wait, what? Getting her health back? Huh. He's just up or down in those things, or I've been lucky? I don't know. Weird, why is she getting her health back? Oh, shit. Now! Oh! Son of a... Oh, I messed up. I uh, reacted too early. Do you want something to see something stupid? Yes. <laughs> I, I, 
I already know about the donkey. Yeah, right, where's their health at? Oh, looks like the it doesn't reset. That's uh, interesting. Nope. Hey, just like we don't go back in time after losing. We just come back after dying. Wait, what? We're just giving them more and more health? Uh -oh. Can I get your number? Uh. What? Can't go to the pulsing thing? Uh, the game broke. Intentionally so. <gasps> the key to leave! Hmm. I have to wonder what ending I got, I guess. Probably a not so good ending. I didn't get all the numbers. I know you can get the blonde gir the girl's number. I'll have to find out how. Well, we just jump over it. That's... I have expected that. We're playing as Donkey as well, so I mean... Strange ending to have with Donkey's face, but uh Hmm. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Wait. Wait, what? Oh. Sometimes Donkey's face just vanishes, but I can't blame them for that. Not not dying? Back we go. As much as it would give me a unique death, I, uh... I can't see those areas. We're going back back. Um, wait. But, wait. Okay, we're not going straight down anymore? The maze has changed. It used to be up and down specifically, but did it revert to how it used to be? We have to escape from the vampire catacombs, more or less, I guess. Fucking vroom. We'll see which way is the right way, though. Nope. Eh, let's try down. Without stepping on any of the book. Okay, well, not that way. I'm gonna assume the ending is going down, but my god, it's going on forever! Where's the way out? No, 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 come on. Oh, you're kidding me. Damn it. All right. I went the wrong way and then I was being chased and I couldn't get out of that because I don't have a shotgun. Wait, what? Hermes. Monday morning. Devil's Tango. Wait, why are the drinks here? What does that mean? I've drank them all, too, so... Weird that they're there, but in undrinkable formats. Not sure. Weird. Wait, is the skeletons fishing now? I wanted to see if I could get eaten by the fish this time, but, uh... <laughs> it's just a fisherman skeleton there instead. Oh, finally? What's this way, though? Nope. Bip, bip, bip. Fuck that. <laughs> Wanted to know if there's some kind of secret. Alright. Oh no. Can I get your number?
What? Wait. Creepy noise. I wasn't expecting a key to be in there. Maybe it was what I needed, though, to leave. Or it's a secret key. Nope, I needed it. Let's avoid stepping on the bones. Nice music. And this door! I, I never was able to get in there. Did I mess it up? I never entered there. There's the button there. But I'm gonna suppose it required you to get all the monsters to walk on it or something. Alright. Next door. Apparently I uh, got like a, a delivery from my Amazon shipment. Oh, that is gross. That's a big fat no. It'd be quick. Uh. <laughs> yes, kind of gross. I mean, they'd be unique deaths. They, they would be unique deaths. <laughs> okay, but then I have to come back all the way here. I don't know if that uh, attribute though to the, all the deaths. I, uh, because I haven't seen them for a while since I don't run by them anymore, but I'd suppose it goes in with it. But it just means. <laughs> this is taking their tongue out. Interesting. But, uh, it would mean if I do have to replay the game and actually get all deaths, and I mess it up somehow in this, and then I can't replay my current save file, then yeah, I would go back and, uh, do what I know I had missed. Such as, like, getting eaten by the fish in the icy lake. Because it's probably, uh, I don't know. Oh, thank god I can skip that. Thank god I can skip most of these things. Very nice. Wait, that dude just... That's a head in there. That's definitely sleeping. There's, there's... There's definitely a dude's head just sticking out, but... Uh, And that too. We're almost back to... Ah, that door not being open is gonna bug me. But otherwise, we still... Wait, can we enter here? Mm, yeah, okay. Ah! Oh, yeah. No, I hit E! Oh, I was too early. God damn it, I had E to go up the fucking door, but I wasn't precisely on the center of the door. That hurts. Right, this time. Oh god, come on, I said this time, I just hit E. Ah. I'm suffering right now. And also, I can't change my head back from being donkey. Is it like... The, the dog made me permanently donkey. Oh god, this is too many. Probably had to run. Yes. Uh, you, you're, you're just screwed. Uh, those guys are sunbathing. In the catacombs. Skeletons are bros, so whatever. Wait, what if I go this way? Dead end? Not a secret. Deaths. Ah! No, wait, I'm missing a few. Yeah. Damn it. What? They just popped my head there, of all times? <laughs> oh, why can't I pet your head still? Huh. And that thing up there from ER? Um... Maybe I'll explore here before going for the gun, because then it might change things back to normal. What? Okay, he's guarding there. Is that a thing from ER just sitting up there? Yeah, what do you want then? 
Try to stay calm next time, sir, so you had so you don't lose your head again. Thank you. No drinks. Ooh. Hmm. Well, the uh the person that died to Godzilla's head is there. Can I not like leave? What happened? I had the key. Curious. Wait. Boy, that thing's guiding me now. No? Wait, what? We're gonna have to definitely follow it, maybe, unless it's an Easter egg. We're still missing a few unique deaths. One there. Uh, headless falling down. So head exploding is definitely one of them, but then there's this one. One remaining. Wait, this is Mario. What the hell? Oh my god. And more spam phone calls. Why, why is Mario being made? I'm wanting to know, why am I going back there and having to re-get the key? Everything's like... Everything's back the way it was. After my head got blown off. Hmm, well, that's really weird, but... TV? That thing is different. Maybe that thing will change the timeline, so to speak? Mm. <laughs> mm hmm Very close. Oh, there he is again. What do you want? Need to reface the boss, I'm presuming, but... Yeah, weird. Time changed. And we're going back to the boss. Maybe the plant thing will interrupt whatever's messing with... I mean... Ugh. Wait, now it's just you. What? What? I don't want to move off the platform in case I can't walk off it, but what's going on? I don't know if, like... Okay, never mind. I'm really, really confused. Right, but we got the key again. Well, having that plant thing possess our body, so to speak, make it so we can leave? Even then, we're still missing the one death. Closed. Maybe it was the fish death. Hmm. Ugh. No idea. Wait. That's been busted open. I still don't know if the shiny coin had any relevance or not. We don't have a shotgun to kill him. Wait, what? What are you doing? You just... What? They had to have the monster kill him. Alright, interesting. Alright, you're in my way. How about you? Thank you. Not sure if he'll just like come and chase me afterwards, but... Oh. Hey, what? Easter eggs. Absolute volts. A bunch of people who played the game. Never heard or seen of these people. Oh god, how many are there? Any I'm familiar with? Yeah, me, me, Nico the Sergal. With when I when I used my face cam still, as I am now. Turbo, I, I'm unfamiliar. Oh god! Then suddenly manly. Yeah, I, I mean, fine. If that's a unique, if that's a unique death, I'll go for it. I need all of them to make Mario's face. 
So I mean, hey, maybe. S suddenly get stabbed by manly badass. Okay, now I can leave that section. Sleeping dude? What the f- Oh, it's- It's the girl with the white hair. Donut, too. Interesting... Snoring noises. Wait. A syringe. It, did, did she have, like, fluid in her lungs? Is that it? Is, is that it? Makes me think of that. It's like if it's like if fluid starts. I can't remember the condition, but there's like if you need to have it, so it's like you have to inject the fluid out of your lungs so a person can breathe. Can't remember. I'm not sure if that was what it was entailing. And this door, still gonna bug me. But all right, let's see if we can actually not die to this. Actually, wait. Don't need to. Okay. It's gonna be the same as before. Yes. Oh, so slippery. You, you get to stay there. Wait, oh! It, close. Unexpected. Flattening. Almost. Almost. Uh, Mario? Mario? No, they're still missing the one! Ah, oh, the one! Hey, am I head gonna blow up again? Not this time. Okay. Let's look around. Look, I don't want to die. Alright. Can I pet you? No! And then I didn't die. Maybe this is just a demo thing then. Jesus. Oh, but I'm missing a death. Hey, come back. We are not done yet. You need to go back in one last time. I need to go back. You're kidding me. My room is very hot right now. Anything you need to say? Case is getting a one star review. That's. You've, I've noticed uh, you've been killed a lot. And the drinks. Alright, sure. Not that I need it, but alright, give me some time and I'll find out what the game wants me to do now. For the last time. Have you been a bad husband? No. I wouldn't say so. Your self-esteem. Afraid you screwed up your kid. Do you feel all alone? Do you regret cheating? Wait, what? What do you mean cheating? Hmm. Was he worth it? Alright, back here now. I'll see if I can do it without dying, eh? or... This again? Why am I back here? Just to do, like, see all those messages. And get the key again. Psychologist, you see now. It's all just a dream based on your past traumas. Now that you have faced them, you are cured, so go out into the world and be happy. Interesting portraits behind you? Wait, wait, are you the red lady? Are you satisfied with this ending? No! Then come back after the 15th of December where we will patch in the true ending. The new content will be the same size as we have played so far. What? Did you expect the game to be complete on its release? I can't remember the last time I played a game completed on its release day. Even Nintendo often releases their games before they are done. I remember when I was playing on my Super Nintendo. Same here. 
Back then we got the whole game on one day. I know, like Super Mario RPG, my favorite. Or Super Metroid, I mean, really anything. Mm -hmm. Yep, you are pretty old. Uh. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. Thank you for playing through the game before the big true ending patch. For this, you will get a special item in the safe room when the game updates. Huh. A singing fish on the wall. Uh. Oh, it was supposed to be a surprise. Uh. Sorry. Mm -hmm. If we sell more than 5,000 copies of Angular Fish before the 19th of January, then we can afford to make a free DLC where you play as the golden haired vampire. Oh. Ah. So spread the word, write a review on Steam, and let us see if we can make it happen. Mm -hmm. We look forward to you playing the true ending. But I want to know what about the Mario face. I'd have to figure out what death I'm missing and where to get it. Because I would assume... Like, unless it just completes the Mario face, but I imagined if I get all the deaths... Maybe it's like the Mario face would be made, and then where the mouth is, there'd be a hole for you to jump down and get an Easter egg room. Not sure. Cancel game voice actors in playthrough. Guest artists. Huh. Thanks for the support, Danish Film Institute. Huh. Thank you for dying with us. Yeah, I died like 45 times. That was a lot of deaths. So we got... Early access ending? I'm not sure if there'd be more endings, though. I'd... Well, let's see what happens if we hit... Wait. You see, it's, it's like it goes into ultra hard, and then I can't change it back. Which is a joke, because I don't think the game can get easier or harder. So if I hit play... What? 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 Wait. Okay, we're not done? Why is it a point-and-click game now? What? Shampoo. What? Timer. Dragon? Dragon said to be facing a specific way? It's a collection? Dragon. More dragons! Oh! Left, right, right. Okay. We're actually running out of time. What do, what do you mean? Is it left, right, right, right? Oh, it's a mirror, so it's backwards. Right, right, right. So it's right, left, left. <laughs> the hell? MP... what? MP5S? I think? No! Don't shoot yourself, shoot the lock off! What is... then... Wait, what? Wait, it went back here. Hang on a tick. That leads... Huh. So then I'd have to probably delete my save. I want to see what happens when I sh my character mm -hmm. then shoots himself, because it looked like he put a gun to his head. Give me one sec, I'll do that one mm -hmm. last time. If it leads back to this, then we end it. But I want to see what happens then if we... Mm -hmm. uh, clicking our character means he shoots his head. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I hit play in it. Ah, Okay, I just hit the play button and it went there. Alright. So I don't even get the dragon point and click game anymore? Hmm. Interesting. Right, hey, that was then the game. I don't know if there's any unique endings, special endings for getting all the deaths. I don't know what that does. It'd mean having to delete my save that's hidden probably in my, like, local drive, whatever. Um, and redoing it all from the start. And petting the dog is also there. And... Getting all the numbers from the blonde girl. I, like, getting it from her and, how, like, all the people. And the demo, I swear, there's, like, numerous things that I would have missed. There'd be a bunch of events or situations that would have happened. Hmm, the true ending. Curious. I don't know, there'd be a few things I'd definitely have missed. Both whatever ending would cause the Mario head to be fully, what does that even mean? If it's not just simply his head is complete and that's it, but I wouldn't think so. I think maybe there'd be something special about it, but I could be wrong. Uh, I didn't pet the dog as well. I didn't get the blonde girl's number and I don't know how. I'd have to spoil myself and look up online to see how other people got it. But, hmm. 
that is nonetheless the full playthrough of the game, though. And the current, I guess, like, the game I don't think calls itself early access, but it is implying... Okay, Steam, can you work? Now it's working. <laughs> um, it's not listed as early access, but they did say on November 10th that November 10th is a release date and that a second playthrough would exist on December. They did say that. Let me, let me read it then completely. Over the next 10 weeks, we'll release a second and third playthrough mode. Each of these new playthrough modes will be a new take on the game. They will be significantly different experiences than the first one. They, they will be both free updates. Those of you who beat Anglerfish before playthrough 2 mode comes out, aka December 15th, will be rewarded with a little surprise. If you beat playthrough 2 mode before the playthrough 3 mode comes out, then another supply, surprise awaits you. We would love to make free DLC where you play the blonde vampire uh, that you find in the game, but for that to be possible, you need to sell more than 5,000 copies. Okay. But yeah, interesting. Uh, we'll have to see then, because there's a lot of things then in the first playthrough that I missed. And, uh, I don't know. Not sure if that'll be detrimental to getting a different ending, but it should all lead to this same thing, basically. Like, I'm not sure if getting the blonde's phone number in the first playthrough, then, means any difference in the first playthrough, or it'll only mean a difference in the second playthrough. Not sure. It's confusing a little bit. But hey, I hope you enjoyed Anglerfish. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a fluff subscriber, hit the notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching, and until the next time. Rrr.